All right, today we got Rodell Williams from Hueytown High School. He's a running back. They have him listed at 5'10", 202 pounds. Let's check him out. The first thing that pops out on film to me is this guy has a great low center of gravity. This makes it difficult for defenders to tackle him because he has such good balance. He also has a natural feel for the game. This usually comes from guys who've been playing football since Pee Wee. Um, you can tell a guy who just kind of started playing football in 8th grade and a guy who maybe just started playing football in high school. This guy has been playing for a while. You can tell by his just natural feel for the game. One thing I love about this guy is not a lot of dance and there's not a lot of east and west running. Um, he's a one cut type of runner. He's getting north and south. Man, I, I absolutely love that about him. He's a pretty solid guy. Uh, you can tell that he has the type of frame that could put on a lot more muscle. That might be something you actually want to watch a little bit. Um, you wouldn't want him to lose any of his fluidity. I think if he does decide to stay committed to Alabama, he needs to make a conscious effort to, to keep his fluidity, um, to work on his flexibility so he can keep that wiggle um, and keep on developing that as well. Another thing I like about this guy is he's a natural pass catcher. I think this kind of goes back to me talking about how I feel like he has a great feel for the game. You can just tell an athlete, a natural athlete, and uh, he, he does a great job of, of catching the ball, looking the ball in. It looks effortless. You know, that's a sign of a, of a good athlete and, and, a, and a good pass catcher. So I think this guy can help a college in the passing game as well. I think he even has the ability to um, be split out wide in the slot. I think he'll develop into a Sony Michelle type of guy in college. Uh, when I see them, I see a lot of similarities. Both guys are solid backs with that strong um, low center of gravity that you won't be able to take down with just arm tackles. My only question for Rodell is, will he be able to make people miss on the next level? Um, I think he's good enough to kind of get into that secondary level. My only question is, will he be able to make that safety miss in a one-on-one -on -one situation? Check out this clip of Sony Michelle right here. This is what I want to see from Rodell. If he can make this guy miss, boom, stick a foot in the ground, boom. But you see how you see how this guy stays at the same angle. I feel like when Rodell cuts, he has to totally change angles and, and cut uh, to a to a totally different direction. Sony Michelle right here, boom, he cuts, but he stays on the same line. He stays in that same direction. I feel like Rodell can develop into this, um, work on his foot speed. And, and and be able to be able to cut and make people miss in a one-on-one -on -one situation i think he'll go from good to great